Hey, howdy, hey, y'all. Welcome back to Shotgun. That's me. So, it's like 12.30 a.m. Friday night. And I'm going to go out and try to find somewhere to fly at midnight. Or quarter to or 12.30 a.m. or whatever. Obviously, I didn't have to work tonight because they took my Fridays away. And, and uh, according to the governor of my fine state of Wisconsin, I might be screwed about working for quite a bit here because they officially shut down all elementary schools and daycares and stuff like that thanks to the old coronavirus. So... Don't know what everybody's plans are for daycare and, and childcare and stuff like that, but we don't know what our plans are either. <laughs> so we're gonna be figuring that out here real quick. And hopefully these pumps are paid at the pump at night. Looks like it. So I'm gonna get some gas and then try to find some light. I got my gates with me too, so if I find a place that's somewhat in non-intrusive with enough light for me to fly I might set up a couple gates um, so stay tuned and if you never see this it never happened goodbye hey 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 we're back so if you've been following me for a long time now and if you go in back in the in the way back machine you'll find plenty of footage of me flying here which is the Tag Center in Mayville when they overhauled this place like four years ago they built this parking lot and put in these gourmet uh, LED uh, street lights or parking lot lights or whatever you want to call it in there. So this whole parking top, par parking top? This whole parking lot is lit up beautifully all night long, which I don't understand why. I mean, I know LED doesn't use a lot of electricity, but whatever, I'm not gonna question it because I don't want them to stop doing it. <laughs> but I used to fly here every night. That's part of the reason why I think I got as good as I did, as quick as I did. And I've never, I'm not, I'm not saying I'm a fantastic, amazing pilot or anything, but I think I went pretty, you know, like I went from like flying one pack to flying pretty damn good in a matter of months because I was so obsessed with it. I'd fly three times a day. You know, I only had like six or seven packs, so I would, I would charge at night, get up, go fly, go to work, charge at work, get off work, fly, go home, charge, and then come back here and fly again. And uh, yeah, so I'd, 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 I only had like five or six packs and I'd still fly like, I, I had at least a 12 pack a day habit. Um, all, all nonstop, forever, every, every day, almost.
I didn't win this transmitter. I would have sold it a long time ago. Transmitter battery low. Would have sold it a long time ago. Because I mean, it's it's a beautiful radio, but goddamn, its quirks are excruciatingly uh, annoying. I, I picked up my DX6 the other day uh, to to sim with it. Uh, for the first time in a long time, and it's, uh, yeah, it is a far superior radio compared to the DX6. The DX6 felt like a piece of, uh, like a, like a, a, a child's toy in my hand versus this thing. But just the operating system and the battery and, and, ah, uh, it's just annoying. And I got this, I did the 18650 mod on it, which is awesome, but I think I got a spring in there that's losing its springnicity and so if like if I bump it or something it'll like kill the power on it real 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 for a split second which I don't know I've I've had to redo like four models because it just powered off in the middle of a model or something and it, I don't know I keep losing models and it keeps crashing on me and whatever whatever it was free thanks for the ride all right, I'm going to rip a couple more, and then I'm going to get out of here. Well, that was a lot of fun. I'm glad I decided to get the hell out of here and go rip some packs. And now it's time to put this on the computer, throw it into Premiere, let it render for six days, because I'm still stuck with my piece-of-shit computer. I got almost all of it right there, ready to go. But FedEx decided to totally screw me up for my power supply. So I've been waiting for my power supply that's said it's been delivered like three times and I've never gotten it, but yet somehow it still keeps changing and whatnot. So fuck FedEx. Um, and uh, thanks to this coronavirus screwing everything up in the world, uh, my job cut Fridays because manufacturing is down. So now I'm not getting eight hours of overtime a week and it's going to take me like another month basically to save up for my video card. So, yay. Um, <laughs> I didn't really mean to end it on such a piss poor note like that, but it is what it is. Peace out. Where are your moms?